So Kate dropped her phone in the water yesterday. Uh, I'm doing this for my sister. Here it comes. Here it comes. You got it? I don't know if he's got it or not. So today we skipped school and now we're gonna go on a hike to a beach. Known as the easiest hike on the island of Mahi, the trail is only 1.2 miles long and took us about 40 minutes. Yeah. Like, you're probably wondering about my DIY hat. I haven't found a visor that uh, goes all the way around for a good facial sun covering. And I always wear my hair up because it's so hot. I don't know how women wear their hair down when they're on boats and places like this, but I always have to wear my hair up. So I cut a hole in my hat. And you're probably wondering why we're walking in flip-flops. Actually, the boys were smarter. They wore tennis shoes. But it said it was an easy hike. And we're going to the beach. At the bottom, you get in the beach and the water. And I didn't want to deal with tennis shoes. I'd like to see you fall there, buddy. I would not like to see that at all. That would hurt. Sand. And you're probably not supposed to climb on those, I would think. Oh, we're almost there, babe. Look at that. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty. Kids already got in the water. Look at that. <laughs> this is beautiful. Good. Uh, it feels great. So Kate dropped her phone in the water yesterday. She was walking on the dock and she was sliding it in her back pocket and it fell off into the water. She was so upset. So we're gonna try to go in the water today. Jack's gonna dive and um, try to salvage the SIM card at least, cause that's something we pay T-Mobile for every month and I don't know how to get another SIM card shipped out here really quickly. So maybe it won't be ruined. That's where it went, Tim, about right there? Yeah, that'll work. Uh, I'm doing this for my sister. Mm. And we wait. What's the time? Um, well, it's, it's 10 o'clock in the morning. Yeah, 10. Your brother's down there sacrificing his. I know, I didn't. He self didn't have to you. do that, but they want the SIM cards, so. Um, you can't get onto your Apple ID without two factor authentication. How am I going to get two factor authentication if it's That's broken? That's why I want to find that. You got to quit moving that line. No, I was moving you back and forth because 
you were spending that time and I was just moving it that away so you could search there and then Kate now says I was so disappointed, dude. Was it? It's best if you just leave it there. Okay, back at Why it. Why not just lay flat and use your arms? I'm not laying flat, dude. That's a nightmare. Is it nasty down there? Oh my gosh. Okay. Yeah, but I do think it was around here. But I could be wrong, kind of a back farther. The next time you drop something in the water, there you go. Hey, here it comes. There it comes. Here it comes, here it comes. You got it? I don't know if he's got it or not. Oh Will you my get gosh. the shipment like we ordered? <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> Goodbye. He got it! Yay. Oh my gosh! Where was it? Was it over here where she said? So I was, I pointed my flashlight this way and held it that way all the way down. I stretched my feet out as far as I could. I went like. <laughs> this far away in yeah. every direction I did a full circle and I was like dude there's no way it's here and I sat there I'm like if I go up now it's never gonna get found so I was like maybe it's not that complicated okay so I reached down right below the weights and it was just sticking up right there so I was like what the <laughs> hell is this like so it was, I was right, it was right there. <laughs> yeah, we stick him right by the waist. Alright, let's get that not SIM card out and dry it off. See if it's, uh, I'm like holding on so tight right now. <laughs> but obviously it's not going to work. No, but the SIM card should be, I mean it's no moving parts in it, it's just a card. So, it might work. It put might. it in this extra phone jack. So extra phone? Extra phone. That musty, crusty water. Oh. Is it the no SIM card went away? Let's check it out. T Mobile, look at that. Let's go. Okay, it says LTE, T Mobile. The only thing I don't like about T Mobile, y'all, is their customer service. Anytime you call, every time you call, you get a different person. So if you have an ongoing problem, you have to start your whole situation over. Even though they should have notes on file, they never do. You talk to somebody in the Philippines one day and then somebody in Montana the next day and it's just a nightmare. But it's unlimited data um, that is uh, somewhat slow, but my kids can text at least. And it's cheap. The Magenta plan is like 20 bucks a month. Now you can get two-factor authentication to How? sign into your, because you have your phone number. Oh, it's on the, oh. It's on there now. Yay. Score. While spending a few days in the marina, we met some folks from South Africa who came to the Seychelles to spend a couple weeks on their catamaran. They have half a dozen young girls on board, so we became fast friends and spent the next few days island hopping with them. This looks like it'd be pretty good diving. It's really pretty. Hey, we met this charter boat, a bunch of South Africans over in the marina at Victoria, Eden Island. And now we're cruising with them, just going around these islands, looking at stuff, having a good time. Kate's over there right now. It's lots of girls. Lots of girls. Girls, girls, girls. Girls, girls, girls. <laughs> We've had enough boys for the last year or two. Maybe <laughs> some girls. Those rocks look like they're about to tumble off the top. Oh my gosh, like that thing in Brazil. 
Oh my gosh. I don't even want to talk about it. Ah, he made it up on the rocks. The only thing I was sketched out about, I would have gone quicker if I was more confident with how deep it was. I was more worried about, I would have gone quicker if I was more confident in the depth. Well done, man. You are, you are probably the first time to see the mountain. I don't think so. Not up that rock. But it's, the climb is the problem, not the jump. Yeah. Pretty much. Yeah. Hey guys, we're out here cruising the Seychelles. It's been a wonderful time here. It's a really pretty place. It's kind of like the Marquesas. It reminds me of French Polynesia and the Marquesas a little bit. Uh, the water's only really a lot warmer. It's like 31 degree water here. It's really warm. But it's been fun. We ran into some South African folks. Yeah, bro. Lekker, man. Lekker. And uh, they've got a bunch of girls on their boat. So Kate's had some fun. And Jack and Finn have been having fun. We've had a great time. And hey guys, if you want to watch another family out here sailing, there's a, there's some friends of ours, uh, uh, Carlos and Alexa. Uh, they have a channel called La Vida Pina. La Vida Pina Vega. La Pina Vida Vega. <laughs> That's a mouthful, Carlos. There's a link. Anyway, click the link. La Vida Pina. Pena. Pena. La Vida Pena Vega. La Vida Pena Vega. La Vida Pena Vega. Christy Vega. Christy Barcelona. Christy Barcelona. La Vida Pena Vega. Christy Victoria Vega. Barcelona. It's not rocket science. Anyway, go watch them. Really neat family. They're on a privilege just like ours. Well, similar to ours. It's a 615 privilege. Beautiful boat. And uh, they're out sailing off of Florida. They got three young kids. And they are so funny to watch. I've been finding things left and right that need to be fixed and replaced. I'm just a little stressed and a bit overwhelmed. But I'm handling it. Then I hear this. Some of the windows. Oh, that's a little warped. Huh. I gotta reseal all the windows in the front. Ugh. 
make sure you follow them on Instagram and YouTube because uh, they're great people. And if, in case you guys didn't know, that she's the girl that played in uh, Spy Kids. Kids. The movie Spy Kids. Carmen? Well, Carmen. Carmen in Spy oh, Kids. She is all grown up. And then, of course, Carlos is an international man of mystery. <laughs> Boy band. Big time rush. Big time Sexy. Rush. Yeah. Hottest man of 2010. Yeah, we're going to go to the beach and check it out. We're gonna, oh, there's all the girls. They this didn't go to the beach. This is the beach we hiked to the other day. You like this and you know it. Do you like this? No, I feel I feel my comfort zone is being ruined. There's too many girls. Really? That's, that's, that's too much femininity. Too much femininity. <laughs> too much femininity. Too much estrogen. Literally. Oh, I thought you were gonna do. A, oh yeah. There you go. Wow. <laughs> Icy. Yeah, it does. It's so icy. You feel like it's You feel like it's Yeah, it's so good. Uh-huh. Like it's not Africa, this one. Alright. It's almost easy. Whoa! No, isn't it like yeah. a little bit shallow? I flip all the way. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh, that's gosh. sketchy. Uh, Do it. I see the same thing badly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is, I did it. <laughs> I've done this once and I laid it on my neck. Oh, I don't know. I'll back you up, bro. Oh, Oh, yeah. Got him. Kate's gonna do it. Totally, you can do it. You just swing your legs and crunch up. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Even though we've had an absolute epic time here in the Seychelles, we're now starting to keep an eye out for a good weather window to head across on another thousand mile journey to Tanzania. So come back next Thursday to see if we found one and to see if our kids will ever be able to say goodbye to their new South African female friends. Okay. It wasn't recording. Hold on, it wasn't recording. Oh, it wasn't recording. Okay, now we got it. Now like, we got it. Should we count down and then do a scream or something? Okay, okay all right. I like it. Okay. Three, two, one. Yeah! Thanks for watching all the way to the end. We'll see you next week.